I know Yoshi played Fox a lot, and now I think plays more Wolf. But we'll see. We'll see. Who picks That's in who this case. he plays. Yeah, I've seen him play a few times, even commentated his matches. But I, I, for the life of me, every time he, he steps on, I'm like, well, I know he doesn't play Yoshi anymore. But I do. yeah, <laughs> it's hard, it's hard to tell sometimes. His name is X Yoshi. You think he play like Yoshi of some sort, but nah, that's not the case. I think for a lot of players, like the longer you stay in the scene, the you, the more you regret if you pick a tag that's like, okay, Mr. Pac-Man or something, and then you're like, okay, I'm playing. Like, I started out as, as Yoshi. Uh, as Yoshi Man. Tag? No, no, no. Oh. no. Uh, but for a while I was Jack the Pack because I switched to playing Pac-Man. Okay, okay. And now I'm just Jack the Mac. But Why the Mac in that case? Because uh, it rhymes, dude. It does rhyme. It, 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 it rolls off the tongue. I, I like it. But also, it looks like Seelaw is actually playing Pokemon Trainer. That's not the option I expected, but Pokemon Trainer is also a very good character, so Definitely. not like not left field or anything. Yeah, I, I think, uh, yeah, Pokemon Trainer is definitely an interesting character, and I'm glad that it's a top tier character because I like to see this character play. It's, I think the meta around when you switch and which Pokemon you use. And, uh, uh, I don't think you should have been using that Pokemon there. <laughs> yeah, you can Squirrel get greedy died with way, way too early. He's the third last character in the game. That's behind Jigglypuff and Pikachu. That's the thing though, right? Like when you're playing Pokemon Trainer, you're thinking, okay, um, and you're in your Squirtle and you're taking a bunch of damage, you're thinking, I really need to get that opening. I really need to make this back up. Um, but at the same time, I, I'm at a huge risk right now because I could, oh. Oh, you want it at all. Got so greedy right there. I like it, though. He, he, he can do that, though. He's, like, kind of bringing a train on Z-Loss currently. See? Like that. Good lord. Yeah, even if your charge out, that down smash will kill at the ledge. That down smash is... Well, that down smash... We know, we know all about that down smash. It got nerfed, like, twice, and still very, very good, I think. <laughs> he went for the spike there. I don't even know what universe that would have worked. Uh, I've seen it work before. It's like... Fair and spike on the ledge. That's what he worked for. Yeah, but he went for like the second hop there. And, like, oh, I don't know what that would work then, yeah. He has, a, he has like a double ream in that case. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, though, doesn't matter. You can do whatever you want. It's only two stocks ahead after all. Mm -hmm. Who really can complain about that? I'm actually that mad that that up B at that height hit, hit him. That's just how wolf up B is. But that up B also is very, very good. And, and a super good shoot also, especially. Especially on kill for sale like that, so. Yeah, I, uh, when Kareen was playing earlier, he somehow beat out Joker's back air with uh, with Wolf's upbeat. Like really? off stage. It was the weirdest interaction. I've never seen anything like it. Hmm. That's a really strange one. Oh. Up to. Give him the boot, though. Yeah. Should I have a height? Just freaking can can him. <laughs> yeah, you don't expect. Wolf to be able to just kind of have that verticality with his ability to threaten, but yeah, only his up smash and up poke can do that. Yeah, both had a lot of both like scoop up a bit, mm -hmm. especially like an up smash. Yeah, I feel like sometimes you're trying to space around up smash, Ooh, sometimes, Kong Kong. Um, and you can honestly, just kind of fall into that. You know, honestly, this isn't a bad character. Pick. Now, I'll, I'll tell you why. I used to actually play D DK in this game a lot. So DK uh, wins on stage, let's say. DK is really good getting in on Wolf. However, Wolf is also really good at comboing DK at the same time. And so and but DK both both characters like have the common theme of like being able to rack up damage really, really well. But and also like once but like once Wolf gets off stage, it's hard for him to get back in this case. Like see that. Like thankfully like Yosha had jump there, but if he if he's not have a jump or a combat out the jump with all that back air, because the back air lingers a bit, so then that would have been it. He also still playing the play is actually pretty well on the ledge at the same time, and this I think it's just it right here, honestly. Y yeah, yeah, look at he that. Yeah, make it back. Yeah, I think right now Seelos having uh, Yosher at the ledge is working out for him big time. But if he ever gets at the ledge, he's gonna be in huge trouble because Wolf can really make this character pay. Just uh, because Donkey Kong is so big, like it makes it so easy to cover all his options. It's a dragon boy, at least. Right. It can be very oh, terrifying this matchup, just because his because his skill power as well too. In addition to like the fact that he can edge guard and get Wolf in a really bad position really easily, like that. See, oh, I think that's dead. No, he, he barely got back. Him. Yeah, but he saved him with that back air. He wasn't gonna make it back. That'll do it though. Yeah, up smash. Great move. <laughs> Super good move. All enough, one of Wolf's like. Oh, ding dong. Oh, no, got out of it. That smash. was a nice smash. Yeah. 
Oh, oh go for again. Try it again. And... Nope. Not the sun. Okay, yeah, some crazy combos there. Yep. Uh, again, going for that down air. That's where Wolf's going to thrive in this matchup is on stage. On stage, Wolf, Wolf definitely wins. Off stage, GK kind of destroys Wolf a bit. But honestly, like, C lost the point matchup very well. He got plays a lot more, like, pretty. Except for, the, except for the recovery. That was pretty sweet. Yeah. Just waited him out there. He was playing pretty well, though. You got to play a lot more, like, defensively and, and like, edge, edge trap Wolf a lot more like this. Either if you're hit grab like that or just your back airs on stage. Just get a bit farther just off stage. Does it again. He's going to make it back, though. Yeah, he can go, he's going to go a bit and farther <laughs> off stage in this case. <laughs> Three times in a row, though, we'll do it. Third time's the charm. Yep. Oh, goodness. Yeah. All right, Wolf off stage again. I mean, wow. It he definitely could have gone for a like up for up air there. Yeah, Sea Loss is, is is winning neutral a lot here. He's yeah, like I said, he's playing this matchup actually really well, and I, I'm 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 pretty impressed right now with his DK. Yeah, but I think all Yosha needs is one chance off here. Like the percents are definitely in C Loss's favor, but if you can get off stage, like up smash is great for damage there, but I think if you could get a punish to send him off stage, he'd be in a better spot. Exactly. But this, okay, is tilt. Bad this could be the right game here. right now. Oh, that was almost it. Okay, Nair. Gonna wait that neutral get out. One more Eftil will do it. Yeah, it all comes down to this. And so he goes for the jump. Good option there, back to say the least. Why did you back Oh, yeah, why didn't he back throw? He should have back throw. Now it's probably gonna. Oh, and he's gonna the game die. Oh, no. Oh, oh okay. He didn't. Okay. Good timing there. Oh, this is so close right now. Ooh. This is pretty much even right now in, in terms of defense. And back air. This is yeah. back air. This is going to do it. Yeah, GG's the Yosher. Taking it with his Wolf. His Wolf has pretty, been pretty good in general. I haven't played his Wolf personally, but I played a lot of his Fox, and 